morning everyone welcome back to Joan day today you guys might be surprised because there's a video on a Thursday but actually I'm gonna try to upload two times a week this month so every Monday and every Thursday and the reason is because November 5th to be specific is the day I started Joan day and to celebrate that I thought more videos because I started Joan day with 365 videos and also two years ago on November 5th we announced the Joan X Neogen collab and it's been two years since we released this cream and it's actually the day before my birthday and I started vlogging on November 5th because I wanted to upload on November 6th so yeah there's just like a lot of things and um, I'm just really grateful to see how much Joan Day has changed and transformed and you guys have been so supportive throughout and so to celebrate, we're going to give away four Neogen creams along with the Joan X soft set in the lavender and green. This set was actually the first to sell out, but we're going to have four, um, four available for the giveaway. So yeah, I just wanted to pop in here and say thank you and film a quick get ready with me because a lot of you guys have been so um, curious about uh, the makeup that I do for mask and I just did skincare. I did toner and essence and I'm just going to apply the moisturizer. So we're gonna go with the day cream. I went through so many of these actually. This is probably the most used K-Beauty product because we had to test it out for an entire year and yeah, I really love this cream. I love how my skin feels super smooth and ready for makeup after the day cream. So yeah, if you haven't had the chance to try it, check the description box to see how you can win it. It may look super sunny right now, but it's actually super cold in Korea now. It definitely feels like winter, um, but that's not gonna stop me from using sunscreen because you gotta protect the skin no matter what. Since we do have to wear our masks everywhere, I don't really wear too much makeup anymore. But when I do, I do like to mattify. And I'm gonna start with a blush. And this is the Tweezy. Very simple. I just like to mattify and add some color. And then using a brow cara, I'm just going to brush and I guess organize my brows. I don't really need more color. I'll use the Fenty Beauty in, in the sun. Eyeshadow, I'm still using the 3C. I have other palettes, but this is just like the easiest. And so I'm just going to use it all over my lids this color all over my lids and then using this maroon color I'm going to use it on the outer corners powder is also super important because I want to set my makeup so it doesn't move around and also to mattify so yeah I'm just going to go for a very natural look today Super simple, I can get ready in like three minutes to be honest, but because I had to film, it took me a bit longer, but yeah, it's very easy. Um, now I'm gonna show you guys how I do my hair because a lot of you guys were asking for tutorials, but honestly, I sleep in braids after showering, I blow dry it, and then when it's slightly wet, I like to braid, and I've been going with the normal braids because the hair extensions, it's just, better to do it this way and so yeah I do a bit of a French braid and that's it um, sometimes when the edges look like noodles I like to recurl them but it looks fine right now so I'm just gonna go out like this today um, I'm going to the flower market with Ayoung and Jem we're gonna have another kind of Joan Jem date it's actually gonna be our first time hanging out with Ayoung as a missus so we're very looking forward to that 
All right, um, I'm going to dress up now, but there's this little gift that my mom got for me and I wanted to unbox it. This is a birthday gift that she got me and let's go ahead and open it. We have a little box from Chanel and I honestly don't want to open it because it's adorable. Let's see what's inside. They're earrings from Chanel. I've been wanting mini Chanel logo earrings and my mom has known that for a couple years now. But yeah, they're perfect for every day and um, yeah, thank you Oma for everything. All right, let's dress up and then head on out. All right, so this is my outfit of the day. Very casual, but very layered. I'm wearing my Burberry coat that I received as a gift last time from Farfetch. A black cardigan from D Pound. A white t-shirt and some jeans from Redone, my favorite. Alright, I do want to switch up these clips and then I also need to pick a bag. But since we're going to the flower market, I think we're going to all have tote bags. So, I'll be right back. All right, I'm going to go with this tote bag that I also received from D-Pound. Okay, and this is the complete look. All right, let's go. We made it to Express Bus Terminal. Jem is almost here and I am said she's going to be a little late. Um, but we're back at Express Bus Terminal for the flower market. This was actually one of your guys' favorite vlogs. I did take my allergy medication and I did bring some with me just in case. So yeah, let's wait for them and then start our day. She's here. <laughs> um, Ayoung had to edit something real quick, but she's on her way now. But she sent us a Starbucks coupon gift card, so we're gonna wait for her at a Starbucks. Shout outs to Mrs. Kim for sponsoring our coffee today. <laughs> we want this <laughs> flower. Hey, go look at that. This one, two, three. Yeah, yeah. 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 Here. Yeah. Oh, but like, this one is like one Like one Yes. My final flower. Final flower. Yay. Put it on. Makers. All right. We did this in like 10 minutes because we found out they close in like 10 minutes. Mm -hmm. So we did it. And now we're going to Ayung Studio because we don't want to carry this around today, so... No way. No way. It's Seoul Forest. Seoul Forest. All right. It's so delicious. Guys, I'm wearing color today. Color! <laughs> color got beige, Yanni. Color. Time to look at the popina menu. Popina. Popina. Oh, we're eating lasagna. Lasagna, we're eating. Yeah, we're eating. Cheers. Oh, it's minimal한 느낌으로 I'm very excited about this. <laughs> Hey, look, this is Mrs. Kim and Hachisa. I'm gonna need Mrs. 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 Hachisa. I'm gon
Off to get some coffee now. Your name here. Whoa, so Your this is. Here. Yay. All right, Gem is gonna go get her hair done. We'll see her later, but bye for now. Bye bye. No, I don't, I need you. <laughs> so we're back at the studio. And we're going to arrange some flowers. Oh, oops. Oh, oops. Do you guys do you guys see Bon back there? Her her hubby. Hello, Bon. All of this was less than thirty dollars. Yes. I got some purple flowers. Got some light flowers. Let's do a flower haul. This is like the perfect fall flower. Okay, and then this one I'm very excited about. Orange. I never go for orange, no. but today <gasps> my heart just told me orange. Uh, this is just one thing to make a picture. Oh my god, it's so good. Kind of flower arrangement. <laughs> this was five dollars. That's cute. This was the most expensive bundle. It was ten thousand won. Here it is. We're now in the auction house. Fancy, <laughs> oh, this is so pretty. Okay, we can't throw away any of the newspapers mm -hmm. because arranged couple Oh, Okay. Oh, Yeah, she bought the most. Oh, they're like honestly speaking, it's so difficult to be there, be there, and vlog. And it's focus. so hard. Yes, focus on buying flowers. Yeah. So I go. I go to one of them. Yeah. You want to take one of these too? Uh huh. You want to take one of these too? Uh huh. You want to take one of these too? Uh huh. You want to take one of these too? Uh huh. You want to take one of these too? Uh huh. You want to take one of these too? Uh huh. You want to take one of these too? Uh huh. You want to take one of these too? Uh huh. You want to take one of these too? Uh huh. You want to take one of these too? Uh huh. You want to take one of these too? Uh huh. You want to take one of these too? Uh huh. You want to take one of these too? Uh huh. You want to take one of these too? Uh huh. You want to take one of these too? Uh huh. You want to take one of these too? Uh huh. You want to take one of these too? Uh huh. You want to take one of these too? Yeah. That's very kinda. Kinda. I love this purple. It's like the Laker purple. I gave Ayoung one of my purple flowers and it just completes this kind of cool aesthetic. Ah, With the doctor... Uh, no, no, no. Prada boots in the background. It's <laughs> very, very cool. Well, Ayoung, that looks really pretty. Oh. Just like white flowers. Just like white flowers. Good afternoon everyone. It is the day after the flower market which explains the flowers by my mirror. We have them in our vases now. And today, I am finally going to remove my hair extensions. I have them in braids right now because after the, the hair extensions are off, I want my hair to look nice and curly. So I'm gonna head over to Karosukir and then finally remove these extensions. All right, let's go. All right, we're at Lumiere and it is time to remove the hair extensions. We're back 
home now and my extensions are finally off. It feels really good even though my hair is super damaged without the extensions. Um, I am loving this lightweight feeling. I feel more relaxed and it doesn't feel heavy. So I am very excited. I'm gonna go get my roots done later on this week and you'll probably see that later on in on Joan Day this month. Um, but yeah, I am going to put my hair up and it's been a while since I've done this. I usually just kept them in braids and I would put them to the back, but I can finally put it up because before it was just way too heavy. So I am going to film a quick get unready with me just to share some of the products that I have been using because some of you guys have been very curious and asking for an updated skincare favorites video. And so my favorite way to do this on Joan Day is to casually share some of my favorites and so first off we're going to remove the makeup and I have been using these cleansing pads from Clavio and this is just really nice because before double cleansing or using a um, like cleanser it already removes a bunch of the makeup and these days I am wearing very minimal foundation so even just with this pad I feel like we're good to go but I usually do like to follow up with a foam cleanser afterwards because I'm really used to the double cleanse but I like to wipe off everything and you can already see the makeup and for the cleanser I've been using this one from Good Skin Days this is Sokol Glam's brand and I really love it. I want to show you guys what it looks like. It's a green foam cleanser and you can see the green tea leaves. But I really like it because after the cleansing pads, my makeup is fully removed and I feel very, very clean. So I'm gonna wash this off. And as you all know, I like to pat dry. My skin has been looking really nice lately been taking good care of it and keeping it moisturized. So of course the next step is toner. And uh, the other toners that I have shown, such as the Fenty Skin, I used up a lot of it. And of course, I love my Troy Adake Skin Complex Formula, but I wanna show you guys a new toner that I have been incorporating into my skincare routine. And it is this one from Glow Recipe. As you guys can see, I used up some of it. And this is the Watermelon Glow PHA BHA Pore Tight Toner. I really like it compared to the other watermelon products that they have. Um, toners are actually like one of my favorite steps because it just, kind of preps the skin for the other skincare products. And the next product I like to use is an essence and this Den I Met You one, I'm almost done with it. Um, I have talked about before, so I wanna introduce a new product and it is this one from YSL. This is the Pure Shots Night Reboot Serum, but it's a very watery product. And as you guys can see, I am pretty much almost done using it. And the reason why I wanted to introduce it in this video is because, um, I feel like for luxury skincare, if you're not a fan of the fragrance, I would say skip because so far, like honestly speaking, Dior Skincare, Chanel Skincare, and even YSL, very fragrant. But um, is it life-changing? Wow, I'm really done with this. I feel like there are other great serums and essences out there, but this one I did finish using and there must be a reason why. I didn't break out from it and that's what keeps me from continuing to use products. So um, if you're not a fan of fragrance or if you don't want to spend like $80 on a serum, there are cheaper alternatives out there. All right, the final step, we have the cream and this is the only product that you guys have probably seen a lot on my channel. Two year anniversary and I wanted to feature this again because we are giving this away. We're giving four along with the Joan X Soft PJ collab and at night I like to use the lavender cream and I really love this because it is super moisturizing. You guys have heard me talk about this so many times so I'll keep it very simple but it is a cream that I absolutely love and I actually used it a lot in Jeju. It was really helpful for my sunburns. Um, but yeah, that's it for my nighttime skincare routine. Um, thank you guys so much for watching and supporting Joan Day. It's been four years since we started this channel and I am forever grateful for all of your guys' support. 
and you guys can stay tuned for more videos this month and I'm gonna try to include a giveaway for um, each week so yeah thank you so much and I'll see you guys in the next one bye have a joan day